here I am still experimenting with the type of coils to make and how to arrange the magnets to get the best results. Of course, you can use very powerful magnets and a lot of them and the proper magnet plate you will need fewer turns of wire but uh, I'm not planning on doing that so for a coil like this I'm getting three volts no problem this is this has like a thousand turns a lot of resistance and no problem lighting up a single LED then I made something like this this is 200 turns I try to arrange it in like a serpentine uh, setup that didn't do much so I'm trying this bow tie this without any uh, help gets about one volt the most as far as fast as, as I can turn this thing so now I'm trying a voltage tripler and this is the setup I have here this is a, a rectifier and two uh, capacitors and this effectively triples the voltage from a maximum of one volt to three volts even though it tripled the voltage is still three volts at the maximum and it is lacking I probably need about 500 turns of wires to make this work but since I made it so I'm just going to show you what it can do for those that are interested in making this type of thing you see on the meter here 2.57 volt that's from the charge that is held by the capacitors so I'm just putting the coil flat against the magnet plate and you can see with a good turn jumped up to 3.5 3.6 volt So theoretically, if I maybe four, maybe if I make at least three more of these coils and lay them on top, maybe I can get to, get to 12 volt. I don't really need 12 volt, but that's a possibility. And of course, you increase the voltage, your current would be lower or I can make three more of this size of coils and I wouldn't need help, any help in increasing the voltage each will give about a little more than three volts if I turn it fast okay let me hook up uh, an LED it's not going to drive the LED that strongly because there's a limitation into the current produced. You can still see it. Without the voltage tripler, it wouldn't. This setup here has a hard time uh, lighting this single LED up so there's a possibility here here's the rectifier with the voltage doubler this configuration I got from Ed Lens uh, is at his website and um, basically it's two capacitors here this is the incoming incoming AC positive negative and then I had that hooked up to this LED here. Like I said, it increases the voltage quite a bit, but it might still not be suitable 
this coil may still not be suitable for this, for this project. This works much better. Okay, thanks for watching.